cosmetics is not just an idea to me. First started by my sister, Peyton, and I, it was initially to spread kindness and positivity to people who had lost everything during the Queensland Gulf fires of 2012. From here, the business began to blossom and incorporate several products by the end of 2013, selling at markets and even providing Australian armed forces with products specifically for their environment. But 12 days before Christmas in 2013, I tragically lost my sister in a farm accident. Since her passing, Cargo Cosmetics has become her legacy. Good evening, I'm Cadence Wilson and this is Cargo Cosmetics. Some may know of Dolly Everett as a sweet girl from the Northern Territory or as the tragedy that brought about Dolly's Dream Foundation. To me, Dolly was a schoolmate from Mount Isa School of the Year and a now close friend to my sister and also to me. But now she's another child that we have lost to bullying. No family should have to go through what Dolly's family have, which is precisely why the Everett's developed Dolly's Dream and why Cargo Cosmetics supports them in what they do. I'm sure at one point in their life, everyone in this room would have experienced the mental anguish caused by bullies. It may have, I may have gotten through it with the help of my parents and friends, but not everyone has these support systems. Calgo Cosmetics aims to spread kindness with each and every purchase through our projects, social media pages and website in conjunction with Dolly's Dream. My business will donate 5% of the proceeds from every product to Dolly's Dream so they can continue to provide education and awareness to the public, schools and students whilst providing programs, tools, educational resources and support lines. My products are made from predominantly natural ingredients that are sustainably sourced, better for the environment and your skin. Our positive affirmations on products and handwritten notes accompanying each order spread kindness and create a better world for everyone. Since 2013, we have been slowly upscaling and growing the range of products and are financially growing without the use of modern business platforms and advertising. Adding to this, the products that I make are something that everyone needs and buys regularly. However, now people can choose to be part of the change. Although I understand that it will initially be hard and to measure the impact my business has on reducing bullying, through kindness and financial support that I will spread, this will provide, see a decline in the number of teen suicide related to bullying. As can be seen from the above financial table and graph, Calgo Cosmetics makes reasonable profit whilst keeping our products at an affordable price. To upscale this business and create bigger change, I will need to expand our human resources and increase our range and production rate in order to reach a broader range of customer base. I intend to target a wider range of events and have a greater social media presence which will allow me to donate more. However, $2,500 would propel my business from market stall to mainstream business. Winning this competition will bring my future aspirations and Peyton's dream to fruition. Bullying is no longer something that we can sit back and let erode away at our children, stealing their future and our world's future. In the words of Dolly, my schoolmate and friend, speak even if your voice shakes.